Hey everybody, thanks for wandering back out to the Digital Hermitage. I'm the Hermit, you can call me Hiccup, and today we're fixing up peaceful acres for all our NPC flameborn friends. We're gonna make this our awesome little NPC hub today. Okay, so big plans, big plans. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna uh, wall off or not wall off, but we're gonna fence off this whole farm because I do believe I do believe it reaches all the way now. Oh yeah, it does. Look at that line right on the wolf too. I mean, it catches the whole farm. Absolutely fantastic. Um, if this wolf is gonna keep appearing out here, we may have to fence this off too and really, uh, really make sure he can't get in here. I was planning on putting the farmer out here. I think this will be really cool. We're gonna put the farmer here, um, and have a couple little gardens here. I'm gonna build, um, <laughs> so there was a flooring up here. <laughs> and the hook has remained, so I'm hoping that, that I can actually build to the hook. Um, and we'll have a platform up here. Uh, but I'm going to put the hunter up here with a little bit of a porch, which gives a little bit of a roof to our farmer downstairs. So I'll just, I'll just get, yeah, that, that'll be cool. We're going to fence this off. Um, I'm not sure what we're going to do here. Uh, but it's a cool spot for fencing. We may even put some more crops and stuff and farm over here a little bit more. Maybe, uh, maybe a different crop or something. I think the blacksmith is pretty happy where he is. This is a cool spot for the blacksmith, so... Uh, what's his, what was his name? Was it Oswald? Is that our buddy's name here? Yeah, Oswald. There he is. Yeah, I think Oswald likes it in here. This is a good spot for him anyway. We'll keep him in here. But yeah, the hunter needs to get out of the corner. The farmer needs to get outside. I think I'm gonna, um, probably move our crafts buddy. Uh, he might, I don't know, he might get this whole area. <laughs> Maybe we'll open up the walls a little bit more and we'll put him down here. And then I think... Uh, the alchemist will probably claim this area. But, uh, yeah, we're gonna move everybody in today. <clears throat> First, I need to fix up this house. That's one of my main concerns. We need some light in here. Oh, yeah. Lots of building hanging out at the base today. Let's get started, shall we? <laughs> Why do my character's eyes look like that? They look a little rolled... Oh, no, now they look a little better. I don't know. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Let's get started. Alright, so light's gonna be a real thing when night comes around. So we'll come and visit, um... Our buddy the blacksmith here when it gets to be nighttime because he has all these awesome candles. I really like these firefly ones. Those are really cool. <clears throat> yeah, so we may spread some of those around in a little bit. Uh, but first I want to start with some roofing tiles. <laughs> see if we and some wood blocks. See if we can fill in some of this stuff. Uh, I want to see if we can just patch up the house a little bit. So. Let's go ahead. I've made these two boxes off camera, and I've been going around collecting material. So hopefully we have enough to do something with today. I don't claim that it's like an amazing, incredible, uh, insane amount of material. No, no. But we've got some good stuff here. I think we can, I think we can work with. Um, let's go ahead and make some blocks. Do I have any pre-built blocks anywhere? I thought I did in here. Yeah, we got some rough wood. Uh, plant fiber roofing. Can we make any other kind of roofing? Huh, interesting. Tart straw, normal straw, plant fiber, stone shingle. That's not it. This looks like what we're... Well, it's not the same color, so we're definitely going to be able to tell that we, you know, messed with it. But let's go ahead and make some. 15, 50. All right, let's see how far that gets us. Uh, let's see if we can fill in some of this roofing then. Like that right there. All right, let me get outside. Whoa! <laughs> well, that didn't work at all. Let me try that again. Little hop. There we go. There we go. Okay. Now then. How to patch a roof. Um. Oh, nice. Okay, so yeah, it's going to be a different color. I don't know how to make this red roofing yet. There we go, we patched it. That's cool. Well, I wonder if we'd be able to make these like red clay tiles eventually. That's pretty cool. I don't have a plan for them yet, but eventually, hopefully we can find one. That'd be pretty cool. But I'm happy fixing it up like this. Oh, look at how easy that is. Wow. Okay. <clears throat> I actually thought this would be a lot more difficult. There we go. It's okay if we use a couple. Put that in right there. Put one in right next to it. Boom! Look at that! <laughs> oh my gosh! That was so easy! Way easier than I thought it was going to be. Uh, 
Oh, are we out? Okay. Uh, is that showing? We'll have to go in and see if that's actually showing. Oh yeah, we're gonna need another piece for over here. Alright, let's go make some more. I actually think we can drop right into our house from here. Yep. <laughs> Alright, let's see what these look like on the inside, though. Can you even tell? Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, we've placed that one a little wrong. Oh, look at that up there. Looks like it placed a little high. Hmm. Alright, looks like we need some more. Let's make some more. Ooh, we're... Okay, I'm pretty sure we've had to make our own tar. Am I... Am I right in assuming that? Who makes tar? Well, that's dried berries. I've been liking the dried berries lately. Those are pretty cool. Um, I'll go back and talk about that in a minute. Who makes tar? Here we go. Tar. Wood logs and dirt. Well, there's some dirt in there, and we're going to keep making some of this tarred stuff. We should go ahead and just plop some of that in there and let it keep churning. There it goes. All right. All right, let's make some more blocks and finish the roofing. Cool! I didn't think it would be this easy. That's actually really easy. Oh, building in this is going to be fun. I really do want to build my own house after this. Um, I'm, I think this is going to be good practice. Uh, definitely appreciating the practice right now. Because, yeah, that little log... That little cabin we built in the very beginning, that was okay. <laughs> it was not the uh, it was not the best thing in the world. It was my first attempt ever. But I'm really enjoying this. This is awesome, actually. Oh, I think that's leaning over maybe just a little too much, but you know, that's okay. As long as it seals it up. Look at that! Why do I feel like that's pretty much it? Well, we gotta get the... There's two sides that are still pretty bad. In pretty bad shape, but that's okay. Okay. It still looks like there's light coming in a little bit from this one. Maybe I should do... Mm, a couple of these coming down. Would it let me? Meh. I, nah, nah, you know what? Never mind. We're not, we're not gonna mess with it. Here we go. Let's finish this up. There it is. Nice. <laughs> oh, yeah. <clears throat> I think that's everything. Let me run around the roof one more time. Um, but I actually think that was all the patches that we needed. Why does this say pick up? Like... Oh, is there stuff in the house? What? Oh yeah, I guess there's this spot too, but I'm gonna get back in the house that way. Well, no, we could... Yeah, let's go ahead and seal it in from here. How much do we have left? Oh yeah, we've got enough. Ooh, why does it feel... Yeah, it's a lot... Sk it looks a lot skinnier than... Ah, oh, it is. Look at that. That's interesting. I mean, we have to build it down a little more? It looks a little more sealed in. Yeah, a little bit. Hmm. Alright, well, I'm not too concerned with it everywhere. Like, that's fine. We'll leave that. <laughs> this is one of the biggest patches we need to make. But well, I guess we need wood block now more than... Yeah, alright, let's make some wood block then. I went ahead and made a bunch. Yeah, we're gonna make like 1,600. That's awesome. Yeah, I'm gonna because I'm gonna build with this over all over the place. Uh, all right, we need more shapes here. What do we got? Oh, hello. Nope, doesn't seem to be sticking through the roof, but also doesn't seem to be as thick. Is there like a two? Not really. Does it? Is it double placed? Is everything kind of doubled? Thing. Right there. Hey, look at that! We could leave that for a little window. That's nice, actually. I think I will. I think I will. Let's get the little blocks. Little, little, little block. Block, block. Oop. Guess that one's not needed. Can't really go in there. Doesn't want to go in there. Alright, that's fine. Right here, too. Here we go. Um... 
Let's see. There we go. Kind of keep a little more out of our way. Cool. That place is sealed up. That's all sealed up. Oh my gosh. All right. Let's seal this up. Ah, look at that. That's pretty cool. But actually, we need this again. Flip it around. There we go. I do believe we've patched the house. Oh yeah. <laughs> it still looks a little wonky. There's like stuff sticking out of it. There's there maybe there's a way for me to fix that. I'll maybe hit it with a pickaxe or something, but you know, I'm not too worried about it. Like I said, this is more for our NPCs, a little less for us. So I really just want to make it cozy for them, and we're just going to kind of leave it for them. And I'm pretty happy with it. Look at this. I didn't place these. These seem to have respawned, and I kind of just want to keep them. And just keep refarming the books every once in a while when the books respawn. Oh man, how cool. Alright, so we're going to go build an actual... Ooh, you know what? Actually, we need some stone block. Uh, rough stone block. Where's the nice stone block that we see outside? Because there's a really nice stone block outside. Not sure how to make it yet. But I'm sure we'll figure it out eventually. Alright, we got plenty of stone for building, so... I'm really excited to build my own base. Like, just build it from the from scratch and just make it awesome. Alright, let's... Uh... Alright, let's fix this up. I need an entrance here, and I'm not really sure how to do that other than to just chop it out. Can I do that? Or wait, maybe you can just use the hammer to remove it. Let's try that first. Uh, okay, control, switch to stone. That's some stairs. We're not looking for stairs. Let's... Oh, look at that. That's a good size. Um, That's really big. It takes a lot of stone. Wow, does that say 600? No, 256. Uh, wow, that's still a lot. Um, Yeah, give me these little blocks. Maybe use this little slightly bigger one. Okay, yeah, that's removing it. Ooh, maybe a little too much. Uh, okay, so ripping it back one does seem to clean up the, like, the really broken up blocks. There we go. Okay, interesting. This is going to take a little while getting used to. Um, there's probably, I'm sure there are, yeah, there's little pillars of everything. I'm just trying to be really particular. I'm glad that you can do it one block at a time like this, because I am. I'm just trying to be really particular right now. Just really want to make sure my blocks go right where I want them. I'm sure it's going to be really awesome to get into some of the other blocks uh, afterward. Is that roofing? Single roof block. Oh, it is. Terrain, wall, cube. Oh, this one's a little... Oh, okay. Single wall, single roof, single terrain, wall block, and cube. Oh, interesting. No, I thought this was just a slope. I didn't think it was a... Huh. Oh, it's getting dark. Let's go mess with some light, actually, before we get too involved in this, uh... In this other project I got going out here. Um, we need... Uh, what do we need? What do we need? Let, let me go look. Uh, oh, no. <laughs> I'm getting too excited about lights <laughs> and lighting. Uh, I got the hiccups. All right, we need fireflies. What do you need, Mr. Carpenter? You're the guy who builds this for me. Um, yeah, we're talking twigs, firefly, plant fiber, wood log. Okay. Okay. All right, we actually had a good bit of fireflies. I think we'll be able to illuminate this place pretty well. We don't need a ton down here. I'm going to maybe make three or four lights and try to space them out downstairs as best we can. Uh, I really want... Ooh, the hanging ones would be cool. Let's do two of these. And two of these wall-mounted ones. 
Good enough. Good enough. Okay. Now then, who needs light? Yeah, buddy. I know you do. Wow, these firefly lamps are not doing much. <laughs> I wonder if we can just get, like, normal torches or something. That's some dim lighting. Yeah, the normal torches definitely seem to provide a lot more fire. Or light. Oh, well, wait a minute. Okay, well, it's not terrible. It's not, like, a ton of light. I do kind of wish they did a little bit more, but that's actually not bad. Maybe it just takes them a minute to get glowing. Interesting. I don't know. Anyway. Here we go. The moon's up. It's bright enough. Let's keep working. All right. We were working with stone out here. I'm going to toss a torch down so I can see a little better. There we go. All right. What were we doing? There we go. All right. Let's get some stairs going on here. Here we go. Nice. All right, let's try and pillar up here. We got this that looks pretty good. Let's just go ahead and... Uh... Oh, look at it change. Four. Four, but I'll go up one, so it'll probably ask me for five, right? Or no, four seems to be the max, but look at this. It knows that two of the blocks are covered. Oh, what a clever little build system. Way to go. That's actually awesome. I actually really like that. Uh oh, torch went out. It's okay. We'll be all right. All right, let's finish. Fill this back in. I'm going to leave some of them, though. It doesn't need to really be... Yeah, see, some of it probably still look good. That does look built up a little. Whoop. There we go. Yeah, there we go. We'll leave it like that. Alright, let's use some rough wood blocks and get a floor going up here. I really want a platform to jump up to on, on with that uh oh nope uh control for this. there we go buttons so many buttons for this okay uh let's get some flooring not nah, bigger than that let's see where's the biggest platform here we go that this one looks like the biggest all right i really want this to place yeah there we go Okay, so we've got to go over a little bit. Is that one over all the way? I would like to... Yeah, if it's going to go one over, then let's make it go one over everywhere. Yes. All right, let's do that all the way around. How perfect. All right, I want this to go out just a little bit further. Because I kind of want there to be like a roofing over the bottom. Yep, there we go. We're going to go out just a little bit more. A little bit more. <laughs> I really do want it to go like pretty much right to the edge. There we go. Perfect. That's awesome. All right, let me go downstairs. Let's put some pillars in. Oh, I kind of want to shape it can we uh kind of want to yeah i kind of want to shape it a little well let's put the pillars in first oh look at these i was gonna use stone pillars though um uh control switch to the stone there we go how cool is that how easy is that too that's amazing oh the building in this is fantastic <laughs> all the wanderers said i was gonna love the building in this you were right. You were right. Oh, I like that look. Let's do that. Let's do the same thing over here. Just kind of like put it, yeah, sink it in the corner just a little bit. There we go. I like that. Nice. Okay, I'm starting to figure this out. The block actually places like 
where the like softly highlighted section of the block is. Yeah, so bonk, and it would place. Yeah, right there. Okay, interesting, interesting. I'm starting to learn. All right, this feels a little small for the uh, for the farmer, but we'll see. But I don't know. The farmer might be standing out here. Really want the farmer to tend to the farm. We need to make a bunch of uh, other stuff here. Anyway, what are we doing? Yeah, we need. This is awesome. This is super awesome. And now with getting up here is a lot easier. Oh yeah, way easier. All right, we need some railings up here. I do probably want to put a little bit of a roof up here. Um, uh, but let's just use some really lightweight wooden poles for that. What do we have? Here we go. Build that right off of the stone ones underneath, yeah. There we go. Is that the same height? Why does that not look like the same height? We may have to go and st just for the look. Yeah, we'll have to stone pillar down underneath those to really keep up that appearance. Um, let's get some lightweight. Yeah, I think there's some smaller beam we can get. Yeah, here we go. I do want a beam in the middle here somewhere between. Uh, let me figure out where I want it to go. Yeah, there we go. All right, I will need some roofing. We're going to have to go make some roofing. But first, let's get some thing to snap the roof to. Like this. Door frame, it says. Oh, hmm. Don't know if we want to use that then. Do I want door frame around the whole outside? What will that look like, though? You know? Huh. It is the only horizontal... All right, we're going to try it. I don't know if this will work or not, but we're going to give it a shot. Now this looks like it's going to work the way I want it to. Maybe. As long as the uh, roofing will snap to this, we should be all right. Yeah. How awesome is that? All right, let's go make some roofing. Ooh, actually, let's stone pillar down beneath these before I forget. Cause I will. If I if I don't do it right now, I'm probably gonna forget. Uh, switch to stone. There we go. All right, put them right underneath. There we go. Perfect. Yeah. Oh man, how awesome. I kind of want to carve a little window out right here so that our farmer has a little more light in here and can look outside and like check out the, uh, keep an eye on the farm. Yeah, we may do that, we may do that. Okay, let's go get some roofing block. That's what I need next. Doop, doop, do. Has the tar finished smelting yet? Or smelting, not smelting. Uh, that's just making berries. Berries are awesome. Speaking of which, I'm hungry. Look at this guy. This poor dude. I'm sorry. Let's eat something. My little avatar is so hungry. Om nom nom nom. There we go. Feeling better. All right. Yeah, tar. We need some tar. Tell me you've made some. That's charcoal. Oh, we had to select it. Pick up. What have you done? All right. Well, we've got plenty of charcoal. Uh, it doesn't look like we're going to have plenty of tar. All right, well, let's just switch up the roofing then. You know what? We're not going to have the tarred roofing out there. That's fine. I'll prepare better roofing next time. All right, so should we go plant fiber roof? What other kind of roofing do we have? Stone shingle's pretty cool, but I might want to save that for our main house that's pretty cool plant fiber i could do plant fiber see i don't know how to get straw we have a little bit of straw but i don't know how to make it myself yet so that could be a that would have been a fun one i think i'm just gonna do plant fiber yeah we're just gonna do plant fiber roofing for this one no biggie no biggie 
You know, maybe we'll move all the firefly lamps out here. Uh, for the hunter and the farmer. They're a little softer. And so, like, maybe out here they'd leave a little bit better. I kind of want to keep all the fire lighting that we have on the inside of the house going on. Yeah, the firefly lighting is a little bit different. Look at this! This actually worked out really well. I'm really hoping we were able to finish my idea here. Um, Alright, let's get back to building. What do we got? Nope, not stairs. We need roofing! Let's go with the 4 meter roofing. Wow, that seems like really... really tall. Um... Nope, that's gonna reach the same... Well, actually, let's keep it lower like this. Let's do that. Uh, can I get up there to work on it? Let's... Here we go. I'm just gonna build this real quick so that I can get up there. Nice. Yep, there we go. Now I can see what I'm doing a little better. Oh, perfect. I did want it to sink in just a little bit and hang below. Get a little bit of an overhang going. Oh, ah! <laughs> Platforming in 3D games. Ah, there we go. Okay. Ah, just a little bit. Yeah, look at that. Oh, that's perfect right there. Let's let's use that. Not sure if that went right to the end or not, but we're just going to follow it down. Can I walk on this? Can walk on this. Uh-oh, we're missing little pieces. Come on, sink in. There we go. And we're going to overhang. Needs build area. Nope, we did. We built right up to the line. <laughs> That's awesome, actually. I really appreciate that. Like, game devs, if you're watching, I doubt any game dev watches my my, my tiny little channel. But, uh, oh my gosh, I love that. I love the fact that it's like, oh, hey, you're just trying to fill in this spot right here. Um, it's not going to cost you the whole 20 uh, pieces. That's only going to cost you, you know, five, because that's how many you're missing. Like, that is so just clever and, and fun. I think that's the same length. We got it. We got it. Yeah, look at that. That wolf is back. I don't know if moving um, a light out here is going to do anything. We're going to have to fence him off because he spawns right on the edge. And that's not cool. I do not want him coming over and messing with our, our NPCs. Will not tolerate it. I didn't want to go up much higher than this. I think we're going to uh, either crown it or flat top it. We might flat top it. That might be pretty cool. Uh oh, I'm out. We need more. Zoom. Let's take a look at this thing, though. Oh, yeah. Look at this little building. That's so cool. We'll have to put some walls and railings up to really finish it up. But, like, that's really cool, actually. I'm pretty happy with that. How cool. All right. We need some more roofing. I guess we go through that pretty quickly. Make a thousand. Zoom. Building, building, building. It's a building day in and shrouded. All right, we may come back with stone and fill those gaps in. Man, when are we going to get access to that really nice stone? Because uh, I'll build a whole base out of that. Oh yeah, look at that. Let's go outside and make sure it looks alright. Not too wonky or anything. But we did actually come out a little bit too far with that roofing piece right there. But actually doing that on purpose might look pretty cool. What is this doing? Floating out here in the middle of nothing. Hang on, let me see if I can build up there and we can fix it just a little bit. Is this just... It is just floating in the air. You can do that? What? All right, interesting. So there's no... What is there, like, no, no such thing as support in Enshrouded? Hmm, something's a little off there. <laughs> There we go. Whoop, what did I just remove? Ah, oh, I removed another roofing piece inside. Whoops! 
There we go. Okay. Much better. Much, much better. Yoink. <laughs> That's fun. Nice. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Yeah, now this place is really coming together. Oh yeah, I want this to be the hunter's spot. It's going to be really nice. Alright, let's put some windows in. Yeah, we might need to leave that a little more open so we can platform up a little easier. Yeah. As long as that's not sinking through the floor, that's awesome. I sunk it one. There we go. Right? Yeah. All right. I do want something else down there. I think we're going to put... Uh, Oh, perfect, actually. <laughs> oh, let's pull this back. Just one more. There we go. Leave that nice and open for us. That's fantastic. Maybe even seal this in a little bit more. There we go. Make it a little more homey. There we go. Awesome. Yeah. All right, I might actually get some real railing to put here instead of trying to make my own. I don't know, though. It could be fun. Make my own railing. Bop, 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 bop. Nah, this would be cool. wonder if the hunter would actually take care of that wolf. It does spawn just outside. I'm really hoping we move our NPCs out here and nothing will happen to them. kind of want to get up there and remove a little bit of this. Nice. All right, let's go check this out from outside again. <laughs> Why is that awesome? I actually really like that. Look. That's pretty cool. Oh, let's bring that down a little more. Nice. We do the same thing that we did. I think it was snapping those little railings down a little further. We, yeah, we can fill this in and make it look natural. Beautiful! Oh my gosh, how cool is this little base right here? Oh, I didn't mean to do that, but that's awesome. Look at the little the little uh, roofing pieces just kind of like slinking down a little further on the ends. I'm going to do that out here! Yoink! <laughs> that's fun. That's just too fun. Let me see if I can mimic that out here. That looks awesome, actually. Just one. Just one past it. Is it one or two? Yeah, just the one. Nice. Oh my gosh, that makes it so easy. Ooh, does that mean I could use this and just make a nice little window right here somewhere? I doesn't want to remove it. All right. Let's go for the single block then. Nice. Oh, now we can just walk right out. What is with that? That's so silly. That's so silly. That's like that's like two or three blocks tall, but you can still just walk right over it. That's really funny to me. That's okay. That's a nice little window, though. Um, what would happen if we did just put some stone here, though? Yeah, you can't walk out of it anymore. There we go. I don't know. Let's do like that. <laughs> Let's call it good. <laughs> oh, this is awesome! How fun. All right, let's go make some fencing. Okay, maybe we will put up a little bit of a stone wall here just to keep... I want to keep the wolf out is really what I want to do because I do think the wolf is going to keep spawning right there. So let's... Let's go ahead and switch back, pull out the hammer. And let's get some stone... 
Okay, here we go. Let's do let's do a little bit of a stone wall defense here. I want to sink it into the ground as best I can, or not. Okay. In that case, oh, here we go. That's that's sunk a lot better. Let's just do that. Yeah, perfect. There we go. Now the little creatures can't get in. Nice. <laughs> okay, that should, yeah, that should do it. Um, oh, I have made a rake since last episode, and I've been messing around with it just a little bit. Very interesting how it, uh, yeah, how the angle can change like that with the ground. That's really, that's really funny. Um, mostly I just want to clean this area up just a little bit. There we go. I want all this to be farmer workable area. We're going to have some little garden. This won't be the main garden, but... There we go. We do need to connect this. I want this road to be connected, because this does turn into... Yeah, on the road. Yeah, so we're on a road, making the little trails. That's awesome. I love that. Okay. Look at this little house. I'm so happy with it. Okay, I think that takes care of the shell of this thing. Yeah, let's go get the lights. I'm probably, yeah, I think we're going to switch. I'm going to put the firefly lighting out here, uh, mostly. We'll put some more torches in here and stuff. I need to just make another fire pit for this guy. Oswald needs that for sure. Um, all right, the farmer, though. Farm soil is awesome. We want some of that. <laughs> the scarecrow is pretty cool. Seed bed is what I want, though. I'm going to make, like, I want to make, like, five or six of these, honestly. Like, I really do want to have a bunch of them set outside for her. So let's, uh, let me collect these, let me collect these firefly lamps again real quick. All right, here we go. Let's make some seed beds. All right, I just made six. Let's start with that. Yeah, seed beds. It's so cool. What is this glowing out here? Why is it glowing? Uh-oh. What got the rabbit out here? <laughs> Alright, let's hang some of these lamps, yeah. I guess that's not terrible. I do wish they were a little brighter. There we go, I want to get that as far outside as possible. I'm gonna do the same thing, replace this one. I'm gonna get it as far onto the outside as possible. There we go. Alright, I don't mind that so much. That's not terrible. I do think the I don't know, we probably just put another campfire right in there and call it good. I don't know. We may put the firefly stuff upstairs. Look at this! This little house is awesome. Oh, I need to make some more fencing for the front of that, maybe. Okay, anyway, anyway, anyway. No, we came out here with the... Where's the seabeds? Oh my gosh, they don't stack. You gotta actually place them. Okay. Alright, well. One right there. One enough space to walk in between them, so... There we go. Two. Let's go ahead and place the rest of these. It's gonna take a minute. Well, how cool is that? Paused. Everything's paused. <laughs> we have six of them. I may make more. I kind of want to make two more. I kind of yeah. Let's go do it. <laughs> I'm gonna go overboard. We're gonna plant so much stuff, everybody. Like I'm gonna go overboard. Zoom. How many more can we make? I want at least two more. Noise. Why not three? Why not? Oh my gosh, yes, this is awesome right now. Loving it. Look at this. Gosh, we need some different lighting. I don't know about these firefly lights. <laughs> I think I just want some normal torches out here. It'll just light the place up so much better. I don't know about these fire. These firefly lamps are pretty cool, but they're, they're so weird and they glow so oddly. Look at that, you can like feel the camera snap when you walk through it. I don't know if I like that. All right, anyway, that's enough of that. Let's go see what else we can build. Uh, 
La da 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 da. Pa! Who have we got? I know, I know. Lighting, lighting. We need to do something about the lighting. I think I have enough stuff in my inventory to make some. So let's go ahead and do illumination down here. Let's see what we can do. Was oh, that just like a firefly lamp that sits on the table? That's cool. Ooh, we could start making candles. That would be cool. Alright, is that how this works? Prepare the staff. Summon the huntress. Yeah, okay, cool, cool, cool. Zip. There we go. I think right here. That's pretty cool. Nice. I don't know what your comfort rating out here is going to be, but hopefully it's not too bad. I kind of want to put a campfire in right here, too, you know? Oh, how cool is that, actually? That works out. We can put the drying racks in on either side. Oh, that's nice. I didn't plan on that, but that works really well. Yeah. Let me pull out the hammer real quick. Can we chop out just a little? Nice. Look at this spot. This is really cozy. Actually, if we're going to put a campfire in there, I may take that wall torch and put it up there and put the standing torch somewhere else. But I really do wish I could continue the... Um... Why can't we? What's, what's the deal here? Ooh, don't do that. Ooh, I'm actually bringing the grass in? What? No. Oh! Okay, so you, like, start, and it grabs the dirt road, and then you can start placing with the dirt road. Is that how that works? I just want to make a path around the corner. Here we go. Oh my gosh, why is this so difficult? There we go. Very nice. Bring the grass back just a little bit more there. There we go. Awesome! Alright, let's get the summoning staff out. And go ahead and resummon the farmer. I don't know if I want her out here. The wolf makes me nervous. I think I do want to keep her inside. Awesome. And we've already made everything that you have to offer, except for the scarecrow. But yeah, we've already made your seed beds. Awesome. Yeah, I think these these two are set. We've got yeah, we got an awesome little garden area. Got the huntress up there. We'll have to make a uh, we'll have to make the trophies for the huntress once she's all taken care of. Need another fence thing right here so we can seal this off. This is a pretty cool little spot. I don't know what we're going to put out here. Alright, the tar is going pretty well. We've got plenty of tar now. He just makes the dishes. Yeah, the huntress is gone. We've got her set up. We'll have to set the alchemist up. You know, I may remove this wall. The alchemist may have a nice little lab set setting right here. If we can just, uh, not dismantle. Shut the door. Close the door. There we go. Yeah, if we tear down the wall in here a little bit, man, we could have a lot more space or even underneath the stairs. I think one of the wanderers was saying I should tear down under the stairs. That might be pretty cool. Uh, and then we could leave the carpenter up here. And he'd have a nice spot. I mean, I really don't need this, this space anymore. I'm not going to live up here. Uh, too much longer. Okay, just built myself a couple of quick little little pieces. Let's go ahead and finish up this little decoration out here. I'm really loving this house. It's a little it's a little janky, a little jambled, a little thrown together, but you know what? I actually really love it. Alright, we're gonna pick up this fireplace if we can. No, I don't wanna cook. I wanna I wanna remove it. Ah! 
I don't like that. We damaged it. <laughs> Can we fix it? How do you repair it? I don't know. Alright, well, we'll have to leave that campfire in there for now. Um, but let's see if we can put one of the better campfires down here. Pick this up. I actually like to... Yeah, there we go. Just raise it just a little bit. There we go. That looks so much better. There we go. That should provide plenty of light in here, I think. We'll have to check back at nighttime, but I think that should do for the lighting. Uh, and then we can get rid of this torch as well. I think this right here will be plenty of light. Between that and the campfire, we should be set up here. Uh, I did build a few more things. There we go, three across. That looks fine. Plenty of... <laughs> That's awesome. All right, we did want to give her some place to sit up here. So we're just going to toss down a bench. Nice. Made a stool for our farmer. Wanted to put another little stool out here. And one right here so we can keep an eye on the garden. Honestly, I'm more tempted to do... I have so much... What is this? Oh, it is out. Okay, so yeah. Control, go down to... Oh yeah, fertile. Fertile dirt. Farm soil. Oh, amazing. Okay. Well, actually, let's, let's hold up on that for a second. I want to go back up here. Scroll over to here. Do we want to use stone or wood? I'm thinking I want to use wood instead. Oh, no, nope. are we out of stone wood block? That's okay. Here we go. Stone will work better anyway. Let me go grab some more of this, and I'm just going to seal up the farm. We're going to just seal in the spots between the fencing. I may actually replace all of the fencing. I probably won't do that on camera real quick. Um, I'll probably just fill it in. Because what I'd really like to do on camera is get the farm going really quick. Uh, that would be awesome. Wow, I guess I did farm up a good bit of material. I thought it wasn't going to be enough. I thought it was going to be like, okay, that feels like a good bit, but I don't know. We'll see how it goes. No, I feel like I got a lot, actually, now that I'm actually crafting and using it. All right, let's go ahead. I need the biggest... What is the biggest... There we go. This looks like the biggest floor piece. And we're going to turn this into... Oh, no. We're going to have to use this with the farm soil. Nice. Oh, yeah. Ah, stop placing it taller. Uh, let me run around and make sure we're not missing any spots, but it doesn't look like it. I think we're good. Haha, <laughs> nice. All right, so how do we plant things now? That's what I want to know. How does one go about planting? Let's uh, Let's go grab a few vegetables and see what we can do. All right, let's gather some stuff. We got corn, we got berries. We got honey. I'm not really sure what I'll be up. Tomato seems more likely. I think that's about it. Oh, m mushrooms. Did we grab mushrooms? Should definitely grab a bunch of normal red, red mushrooms. Okay. Now then, let's uh, let's go check out the seed beds real quick. Shrub seedling. Ooh, recipes. Look at all the recipes. <gasps> okay, okay. Awesome. All right, let's do mushrooms under here. So what do we need? Bone meal and mushroom. Oh, 
Oh, I see how this works. Sorry, so we need a lot of bone meal. No, I don't want to use all 30. How do you... Yeah, split. Split. Not delete! Ah, oh, hiccup, what are you doing? Alright, we gotta go grab some. <laughs> Let's go get a bunch of bone meal. I do have a bunch of bone meal. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, so how do we plant things on the fertile ground? I don't know, but let's do this first. I kind of want this. This is definitely going to be mushrooms. Alright, we need to split this stuff up. There are... How many... Um, one, two, three... Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There are nine, so we need nine stacks. Split. Split. Split, 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 split. Ah, if only I had a little bit more. Let's go get some more making. <laughs> oh, we have plenty. There we go, 12, 11, or 13 for each one. That seems perfect to start with. And I forgot, we got to get that table and grinding wheel out here to the farmer, because that's where... That's where she really needs it. Alright, so let's go ahead and just toss 11 in here with the mushrooms. Kind of wanted to get veggies and stuff out here. Let's do tomatoes right here. Oh, tomatoes take wa- Oh, it's different! That is really cool. That's fun. Alright, tomatoes take water. I like that there are eight different recipes and we made seven. Berry bush. Farm soil, water, and purple berries. Jeez. Okay, so water is becoming another issue. <laughs> Alright, so we got berries, we got tomatoes. Um, what's next? Corn. Corn and water? Oh my gosh, we're running out. takes three water? Oh my gosh. We need to be harvesting water way more often than we are. Alright, everything else takes water. Oh my gosh. Well, I know mushrooms are super easy for us. Let's just go ahead and get like two mushrooms going in here because the mushrooms are silly easy. Yeah, that's silly easy. Alright, and then the other thing we could get going is uh, the shrubs. That's got something. This isn't. No. I'm gonna do the two very back ones as shrubs. Let's just do that. Yeah, let's uh. Split stack. Let's put 100 in here. And that's all you need. The shrubs grow by themselves. So if you put 100 in each one back here, I think we'll have scrub. We'll have shrubs forever. Alright, this is supposed to be growing. We don't want that one to be growing shrubs. We want that to be going. I don't know what broadleaf is. Or evergreen, actually. Okay, so we've got mushrooms and mushrooms. Those are turning out. This one is tomatoes. This one is berries. That one is... Not shrubs. Should do something else. Probably the broad leaf, I guess. That's corn. Okay, now she's gonna need some storage and the table and the grinding wheel, but we've got everything growing, which is pretty cool. Look at it grow too, like you can literally watch it grow. And that's, yeah, that's just making so many mushrooms. Oh my gosh. Just go ahead and double up on that. We'll never go hungry. Mushrooms aren't super necessary. We need water. Oh my gosh. Like, yeah, I need to go and start collecting a lot more water. Uh, that's going to be difficult. Is there not a way for me to collect water at home here? Like, is there not a well nearby? I need something. Alright, what about planting things just out here? Let's try out this new torch we just got. Oh, look at it. It's kind of big and bulbous, actually. Alright, let me see if we can just plant some... I want to just, like... Uh oh let's go grab a tomato or two. I just want to see if we can plant them out here. Is that is that how that works? 
Which one of you was making tomatoes? We had corn. Let's split that stack. Split that stack. Just give me five corn. That's fine. And where's my tomatoes? Okay, five corn, five tomatoes. Is there a way to just... No, because if I hit that, it's just going to eat it. So how do you plant these? How do we use the fertile ground to plant? Is it part of the hammer again? Is this how we build? Oh, round. I like that. That's cool. Disc. Nope, this isn't it. All right, so then how do we... All right, that's far. We've got a bunch of farm soil out here. So what does this do then? <laughs> uh, maybe there's just a tool. I bet we're just missing a tool, probably. There's probably just a tool we're missing. We'll have to come back and try that again. Did I just break my own? I did. I'm so bad about it. I really wish... Okay, so pet peeve of mine. Tiny, tiny, tiny pet peeve. But uh, I really wish I could hit, you know, my, my torches on two. When I hit two, he attacks with it. I wish he put it away. That's all I'm saying. I wish there... I, I don't like keeping a slot open on my hotbar just so I can have nothing in my hands. But sometimes I like to walk around with nothing equipped. You know? Um, but gosh, I just destroyed a little stool. I'm going to break so much stuff in this game doing that, I'm, I'm sure of it. Well, look at all the cool stuff. I need to go get water, man. Oh, man, where do we collect water? And how do we plant things? I'm not quite clear. Maybe we just don't have the material or the tool yet. Um, yeah, maybe, maybe. There we go. That looks pretty nice. All right. Okay, well, I've got a little more decorating to do inside. Um... I don't know, though. I think everybody's got all their tables built next to them. Like I said, we need to move this table. Um, can I pick this up? We can pick this up. Cool. Yeah, let's get this table. Uh, I'm going to have to move all that wood and food out there, too. Um, yeah, all of this stuff can come out here with me. I'm kind of... I'm kind of I'll work on the house in between episodes, probably. But for now, I really am enjoying this spot like this is really nice uh having worked on this is pretty cool oh it's not so bad in here no put the weapon away uh maybe we could hang one of those um i gotta go put all these back maybe we could hang one of those firefly lanterns in here i suppose um probably wouldn't be a bad idea Very cool, super comfy. Yeah, we need some tables and stuff upstairs for our uh, our hunter too. She's got a cool spot. Oh, hey, this is finally done. All right, collect that, collect that. Yeah, there we go. All right, let's swap that out for the actual fire pit. Please go in. Oh yeah, it does. What did I just do? Did I just pick up the one from downstairs? How does that work? That's just silly, hang on. I think I did though. Yeah, I did. What? That's just silly. There we go. All right. Was that a little less? Why does that feel like a little less light? I think it is a little less light, but you know what? Also, it, it's it's lighting up just fine in here. I think it's fine. We're good. There we go. We'll put a firefly lantern anyway. <laughs> uh, I think I do want to include a firefly lantern over here underneath the zip. Yeah, there we go. Nice. This place is awesome. That little shack just came to life so well. wonder what this fertile soil is going to do. I'm happy we made it, but I don't know what it's going to do for us yet. <laughs> Ooh, can I hang this here? <gasps> I can! That's awesome. Yes, please. Cool. Well, all right, everybody. I guess I'm going to go ahead and let that wrap up the episode for today. We got pretty distracted kind of fixing up the roof and then working on our little... Um, hunter and farmer shack out here but i'm really happy with it i'm really happy with the way it came out it looks really cool it's a little wonky uh we don't have the same build material that we need to copy exactly what's going on here but i think we did pretty good i think this is really cozy and i really like this whole like crafting uh little farm area that's really cozy i'm gonna have to go and get us a bunch of oh is there a piece missing in that stair it looks like there is 
Oh, it was a wooden block. All right, well, yeah, get rid of that. Just put the stone in. That looks better. Anyway. Ah, yeah, I'm just really happy with the way this turned out. I'm going to do a little more decorating probably inside, but it won't be much. Um, we're just going to add some tables and stuff around. Um, yeah, maybe probably the most dramatic thing I'll do is take down some of what we have in here. I love this guy to death. Balthazar is awesome. And we may end up taking out some of the wall in here. Let me just go ahead and mess with it, see what it looks like if we do it. Delete. Can we walk in here now? Oh yeah, look at this. Look at this little space under the stairs. And a, and a window? What? They've been hiding this from us. Alright, let's let's uh, let's cut all this out so we can have Balthazar have a much bigger space back here. I'm pretty sure a wanderer told me about this. Some wanderer was like, yo, Hiccup, check out underneath the stairs. I'm glad they said something. Thank you so much. This is pretty cool. Yeah, that's actually really cozy. I kind of wanted to take a little bit of this wall out, too. Like, I don't really know that we need it here. Um, how much of it do I want to lose, though? That's the question. But I kind of do want to free it up and make... Wow, this is a pretty good size space. Balthazar might be fine right here. Oh, yeah. See, that's pretty cool. That might be... Exactly what Balthazar needed. Can we open that up a little more? Hmm, I may want to seal it up. We may, like, bring the stone down. Do, 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 and really seal ourselves in. Maybe, maybe. This is pretty cool. Okay, but that's enough of that. Before I get way too distracted and just keep going, <laughs> I'll let it wrap up right here. Next time, we'll probably do a little bit more building around here, and then we've got a lot more adventuring to go on. We have so many things that we need to find for so many of our friends. We're talking mortar and pestle. We're talking uh, hunting grounds that the Huntress uh, pointed out to us, and there's so many things on the map. I'll go ahead and just pull up the map for a second. Oh, map's playing funny things with me. But yeah, we have like the Alchemist Mortar, the Queen's Tomb, the Alchemist Rumors, a story of rot, Southern Caravan, a test of skill. We have so many things up in this like northern area that I want to go and check out and do. But we also have Eternal Spell down here, another Spire that we really need to go and do. Uh, oh, the Vuka Ceremony. I'm not really sure what that's all about. I think we just found that out. But we have a ton of things to go. Um, oh, the Hand Spindle. Yeah, I think we're going to spend a lot of time up here next episode completing a lot of this stuff so that we can unlock some more stuff for our craftspeople because they do need a couple more things and uh yeah we really need to get that to them Anyway, everybody, thanks so much for hanging out with me today. If you had fun, do me a favor, smash that like button and be sure to subscribe if you want to continue the adventures in Enshrouded. Yeah, this spot's feeling pretty cool. Like I said, I'll probably do a tiny bit more decorating on the inside of the main house, a little off camera, just a little bit. And I may go and grab some more water uh, from the well, but um, besides just like fixing this place up a tiny, tiny bit more, uh, fencing off a few more sections, and then really just a table or two in here for our buddy Oswald. And uh, Balthazar is going to live down there. And I do think that we're going to go ahead and give this whole entire upper area to our good buddy What's his name? Kane, the the blacksmith? Yeah. Um, so we can probably give this whole upper area to him. Um, I may turn one of these rooms into just nothing but storage. Possibly, possibly down here. I might actually wall this off somewhere and just turn this at the top of the stairs into a storage area. Um, I do want to put a storage box with, like we have down here, I do want to put a storage box with each one of the craftspeople. Um, this is pretty cool, though. I think this is plenty big enough for our blacksmith. Or, I mean, our alchemist Balthazar here. That's pretty cool. Anyway, I'm rambling way too much. Yeah, I'm going to do a little bit off camera, but next time we'll be adventuring a little bit more, um, going out and really just trying to find some more stuff for all our craftspeople so we can unlock more recipes, more building stuff. But we're also going to be scouting for a new base spot from here on because this place is pretty cool. And I'm not done here. Like I said, I, I definitely want to keep decorating, keep building it up just a little bit. So we're going to keep mo keep moving forward, and we're really going to turn this into a really pretty hub uh, for all our NPCs and really just have a lot going on here, and it's going to be awesome. So it's gonna, we're not, like, ditching it completely, but I am looking for my own place. I do want my own house 
uh, to live in. So we're going to go and, and keep an eye out for that. But anyway, I am starting to ramble too much. I'm repeating myself. I hope you're having a great day, everyone. Thanks so much for hanging out with me. Have a great rest of your day. Ooh, I was just about to say goodbye to everybody, and the wolves spawn back. But yeah, they can't get inside. That's right. Go sit down. We're not scared of you anymore. I've blocked you off. There is no path inside, and you're not doing damage to my walls. Awesome. <laughs> anyway, everybody, I hope to see you in the next episode. Until next time, have fun in your own adventures. Good luck, and I'll see you in the next episode. Ah, all right. Let's go make some tables. Let's go.